Hey everybody, welcome back to B&B Rips. I'm Brandon and I'm here with Bo. Hi guys. And today uh, we grabbed another hobby box of 2023 Top Series 1 from our hobby shop. Um, we've opened a couple of jumbos, we've opened one hobby box and it went pretty well, didn't it? Yep. Do you remember some of the hits we got out of there? An auto. We did get an autograph. A, um, a Cunha? No. No. Oh, I wish it was a Cunha. Oh, um, Cade. Cade Cavalli, I think was who it was. But. But we, we, that wasn't our auto. What did we get? We got a really nice parallel. Uh, camo? Yeah, camo. It was a Brave. You're right. Ozzy Obbies? Oh. Yeah. Our, that was our best hit. Um, yeah, definitely we got an auto, which is not guaranteed out of here. You're going to get an autograph or a relic. So we did, we did get an auto. And I think more autos have been coming out of Hobby this year than years past. Usually it was like you know, almost guaranteed to get one of those major lead material. Um, <clears throat> oh yeah, I forgot we got a silver pack out of there too. So, oh, you're taking that one? Mm -hmm. So Hobby Boxes have been awesome. Um, things that you can buy at the Hobby Shop have definitely been producing more hits uh, than retail. I'm sure you guys have watched enough or heard enough about the retail odds that it's it's kind of scaring us off. Um, like one in every 99 packs did a gold card out of retail. So um, Jumbo is definitely the way to go if you can go Jumbo. Uh, we would just wanted to check out another hobby. Um, Let's rotate. You want to rotate again? Okay. So, let me sure that we have an even amount of packs. There are 24 packs, sports and cards per pack. Uh, I think I got something. You got something already? No? Well, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Tatis. I'm going to rotate this. Yeah, we got 12 packs each. Let's see what we can get. Okay. Oh. Yeah, it was just a one two punch insert. Okay. I don't think we have that one yet. Nothing else. So, yeah, so that's what most of these packs uh, look like in the first box. So, we're just looking for the parallels, looking for the hits. A nice rookie parallel would be fantastic, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. Like an Adley, Gunner, Riley. But uh, we'll see what we can do. So, I remember, if you remember the last hobby box, you guys go back and watch the video if you haven't. But I think we had a lot of base packs, if I remember right. Yeah. There's a nice Gunner. There's a nice J Rod. Oh, there's a good one. Uh, Michael Harris, one of the biggest rookies in this set, so I, I like that one. Uh, Michael Harris, the second. Yeah, you're right. No disrespect to Michael Harris, the first. I'm sure he was a good ball player in his own right in his day. Did he play? I don't know. Yeah, those are cool. I like the 88 design. Definitely. I'm going to set that up there for now. Let's get something on stage. Jordan Alvarez. Freddie. Lots of Dodgers in this pack. Mm -hmm. I think we got a base pack. Yep. So we've had really good success on Series 1 this year. We were really excited to get back up to the shop and pick up some more um, from the guys. And the, the, the hobby boxes are still sitting at a pretty decent price. Um, I think we got it for $90, which um, you can get one or two one or two cards in this thing can get you your value back if you get the right ones. So that's what we're kind of hoping for, right? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so we appreciate you guys watching. Um, love to hear from you about what you guys have pulled out of Series 1 this year. There's Keegan. Um, <clears throat> you had some success like we have. or so you bought retail even if you, you've had success. Um, I bought one blaster. I broke down bought one blaster. And I, I beat the odds. I hit a card. Um, welcome to the club. And it was a gold parallel out of there. Out of 75 and apparently you can get one of those in every 36,000 packs out of blaster boxes so um, I beat the odds on that one it was a Dale Murphy so that was pretty crazy I have a feeling there's an Adley oh, uh, each row there's a nice 88 parallel I like those designs okay, it's not parallel just the insert Michael Harris second so I'm hitting most of the rookies again I think we saw Adley Gunner and Michael Harris a second now so yeah, definitely hitting all those rookies out of this so, can't be upset about that. I got some kind of insert in here. So yeah, so the hobby hobbies are pretty much um, you're lucky to get one insert a pack if you're lucky. So, um, so base and then one insert and then so that's a welcome to the thirty thirty club. So that was one of the ones I hit out of the blaster. That was like a one out of seventy five. It was 
Pretty big hit out of there. Guys are really hard to pull. All right. So nothing exciting. I don't think we've hit one single solid parallel, right? We haven't hit any color. You can get something in here, bud? Maybe? Mm -hmm. So we should definitely get at least a rainbow foil out of here. Maybe we'll get lucky and get a gold. Or did you get a relic? Yeah. Let me a see how black. it is. A black variation, though. Out of 199. Out of 199. So, nice. hey, if you're going to get a relic, it's nice to get a, get a parallel. Too. Cool. Not We're not the biggest Astros fans in the world, but that's not a bad hit. Nope. Not a bad hit. Not so. bad at all. Cool. Out of 199. At so. least it's numbered. It is numbered, so out of our two high boxes, we got one relic and one auto. Yeah. Alrighty. It's not a bad relic. No, no, no. Jose Altuve is a good player. Say what you want about the Astros. He's a good hitter, isn't he? Mm -hmm. Alrighty. And I think I got a base pack. Oh. So there's Josh Smith. Um, we did hit his golden mirror variation. Um, in our hobby video, if you want to go back and check that out, that was pretty cool. Those are really tough pulls. We need, we need, we need more number. We definitely need some number. We need, let's get a parallel out of here. Give me a... Give me a one-on-one. -on -one. Whoa. That'd be amazing. Mm -hmm. Flat one parallel. Why would I say that? I get it. You're asking for a lot. That's a nice, cool-looking insert. Aaron Judge. Greatest hits. Mm -hmm. I don't know what about that. <laughs> Wherever you feel like it. Wherever it feels right. Cool. <clears throat> so, um, it's been a night, it's been a rainy day here. I think it's rained three or four inches today, hasn't it, Bo? Mm -hmm. Pretty crazy. We're, we're pretty lucky to get up to the hobby shop today. Um, we're supposed to get storms all day long, but we we toughed it out and we made it up there. There's another 88, Brian Bello or Brian. How do you think you say that name? Brian. Brian or Brian? Brian. Somebody can let us know. We said it wrong, we're sorry. We're sorry, Brian or Brian, whatever your name is. I'm sure you're a good picture. Still looking for a first color. Did you get one in here? I saw something shiny. Yeah, I see something shiny too. Garrett Rainbow Cooper. Foil. Garrett Cooper, all right. So that's kind of a dud. Mm -hmm. No offense to Garrett. No. Just not the guy we're looking for, is it? Nope. All right. We want, we want rookies. Yeah, we don't want, we want a rookie parallel. Let's get another camo, another or a Independence Day. Anything would be great, wouldn't it? Mm-hmm. All right. Another green. There's Brandon Hughes. Green, and I got a base pack. So I'm going to keep looking at the backs, make sure we're not missing anything. <clears throat> I don't see anything in my stack. Cheater Downs. George. Eli. Gavin Lux. Dominic. Gavin Lux just got hurt the other day, and he's out for the season already. Jacob DeGrom, 80. 88? Yeah, 88. So that would be so rough, there. man. In spring training, you've been working all off season, get ready for the year. He was going to be the starter for the Dodgers again this year, and he got hurt in spring training. Man, did you hear about that? Mm -hmm. Gavin Lux. So, I already decided he's going to miss the whole year. That's <coughs> just feel so bad for him. There's your guy, Patrick. Patrick. We're collecting his rainbow, aren't we? Yep. If anybody's got the one on one out there, we'll take it. Right? Yeah. We can actually complete this year as we tried last year. We got a whole lot of them. I never actually saw the one of one come out. She's uh, probably still out there. there Somebody's got, I'm sure there's still a lot of, a lot of that product to open. Um, so, you see it floating around. We'd love to grab it up. We're big Patrick Wisdom collectors, aren't we? Mm -hmm. John Gray. Wander Franco. And then with nice Cody, right. new cubby. Yep. Right, so we've got two rainbow foil, which is about what you expect out of hobby based on the odds. Um, the odds you get one rainbow foil out of every 10 packs, but then the odds do get tougher. Um, gold is one of 33, green is one of 135, orange one of a 227, 
Red, 345. Black is one of 262. Then we're getting into the thousands for everything else. So, um, I mean, not great odds, but I mean, be hopeful to hit at least another numbered card besides a relic. Mm -hmm. Sure would be nice, in my opinion. There's your buddy, Marcus Stroman, yep. who was nice enough to uh, retweet Bo the other day. Bo made a cool, there's a nice aces insert. Bo had made a cool um, art project of Marcus Stroman. It was a lot of paper. Uh, yeah, it was paper art. Um, and you also take out Marcus Stroman's book, and we take a picture of Bo and Marcus Stroman. Um, did a quote retweet on it, and uh, he said he appreciated the artwork, so that was pretty cool That's that we got that interaction. Was the big league player, huh? Mm -hmm. Bo's got some interaction with a couple of big league players on, on Twitter. Um, a few years ago, he got Anthony Rizzo to tell him happy birthday. Yep. That was really cool. Patrick, mm -hmm. Frank, Kendall. Yeah, those guys weren't on Twitter, but they were yeah. just sending messages down there. Yeah. All right, let's see if I can start hitting anything. I haven't gotten, I've got nothing on my side of the box, man. We've gotten the two parallels and the hit. It's like last time where you got everything. Is that what happened? Yep. All I've gotten are these inserts. All right, so, so far this has been a bit of a dud. I'm, I don't mean to complain, but no big hits yet. And we're running out of time. we got six packs left, so hopefully we pick up the pace here. What do you think? Yeah. I told Bo I'd love to hit one of those clear acetate cards. We're going to hit it at us now. Like we are? Okay. Yeah. I sure hope so. It's just that'd be, hiding. That'd be amazing. Base. Base, 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 base. Base, base, base. All right. I don't like base cards. <laughs> There's no fun in that, is there? Mm -mm. Uh, I think I got a rainbow foil. So maybe it'll be a one of the big rookies, and that will make make this box a little bit better. So, Cody Clemens. There's a Bobby Witt Jr. rookie cup. Oh. Okay, so we got a home run challenge. Who did I get? Uh, Seth Brown. Well, we got a few colored cards, um, but nothing big time yet, right? Still time. There's still time. You like that card? Like your full aces, mm -hmm. full inserts. Silver pack. Auto? We've actually gotten really lucky on the silver pack. We've we've opened what, five silver packs, mm -hmm. and out of th three of the packs, we've gotten a color. Mm -hmm. That's really rare. I saw um, another video we were watching. He was doing 100 silver packs, and he opened about the first 20 silver packs. He didn't hit a single colored card. Nope. Now it hit. He heated up a little bit after that, but really, I mean, it shows you how, <coughs> how tough it is. There's another one-two punch. To the collection. I don't think we have that one, but nothing else. All right, buddy. This, is, this has been tough. Magic. This has been tough, 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 tough. Still, this is just uh, proving that Jumbo is really the way to go, isn't it? We did better on our last hobby. All right. Still pretty fun. We hit all the all the rookies again. We got a nice, nice numbered hit, numbered relic for Valtuve. No, but, I'm um, all right, my last pack here, and I'm gonna let Bo open the silver pack because I'm a nice guy. So nice. Get us a number. We only have uh, one number. Oh, we had a gold, so that's that's tough. So hopefully it's somebody good. We need it. We if need, it's you, we need good vibes. Who huh? would be good? Um, Riley Green or Adley or somebody like that might be better this year, just because it's a rookie card. Brave. Nope, the Dodger. Dodger. It's Clayton Kershaw. Not bad. Uh, no, not bad. Clayton Kershaw gold. So we did get a second numbered card. Um, we'll two numbered it. cards out of the box. So a whole hobby box. Which No, but yeah. Well, out of the base box. Um, 
to number three, which is kind of a bummer, if I'm being honest, but we'll see if we can get something good out of here. We have a number. Did you get some beef in there? Yeah. You got some beef? All right. Well, maybe being autographed, that would be major. Here's a nice Tony Glenn. Purple, purple giant. Giant. Oh, that would be Will Clark. All right. So our, our luck continues in the silver packs. Um, that's seriously four out of six silver packs. We've hit a number card. We've hit a number card. So that's we're beating the odds there. That's for sure. So um, let us know what you guys think. Um, this was definitely not the greatest greatest box you've ever seen. Um, I can't imagine. Um, but it was still a lot of fun. We got a nice sit. We got a nice numbered Mojo Refractor and a Clayton Kershaw Gold. Hit all the big rookies. So. Um, Leave us, leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Uh, we did have a good time opening this. We do still love 2023 Series 1, right? Yep. All right, buddy. So um, like, subscribe, comment down below. We'd love to hear from you. Comment we appreciate what your you guys. Comment favorite card was. Yeah. So, all right, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye. And stay tuned for other videos.